Apologies were issued by major media outlets in the United States and the UK. This comes after they provided not only with incorrect information about Korea, but also making insulting and ignorant remarks about the host nation during their Olympic coverage. Park ji has the full story. British newspaper The Times made some jaw-dropping errors in a photo caption on Saturday. The caption of the photo about the unified Korea flag carried by athletes from the two Koreas during last Friday's opening ceremony incorrectly read that Korea lays claim on an island owned by Japan. The caption contained two glaring mistakes. First, Korea's easternmost Tokyo Island is legally and historically Korean territory, and secondly, they circled Korea's southern resort island of Jeju-do on the flag as the supposed island of contention. The paper apologized about the errors on its website on Sunday. American network NBC also had to apologize after one of its commentators made a highly inappropriate and uninformed comment during the opening ceremony. Joshua Cooper Ramo said because of Japan's 36-year colonial rule of Korea in the early 20th century, quote, every Korean will tell you that Japan as a cultural and technological and economic example has been so important to their own transformation. The outrageous comment not only showed a blatant misunderstanding of the Korean people suffering during Japan's colonial rule due to various atrocities, including the wartime sexual enslavement of Korean women, but also insulted the network's Korean-American viewers and others aware of the region's history. After receiving a flood of complaints, NBC issued an official apology during one of their live shows and another apology in writing in the Washington Post. NBC also says Ramo will not appear on any further PyeongChang Olympic coverage. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.